Tanya and to Terrell, CPS CEO Pedro Martinez will speak before council members today in an education committee hearing to discuss the district's budget. Now, Martinez told the ABC7 there's been a plan in place for months to use the city's TIF surplus dollars to help fund CPS. Martinez says there was a formal ask for $462 million in TIF funding to pay for pensions and union contracts, including 4% raises for the teachers union. Mayor Brandon Johnson wants a district to take out a high interest loan to help pay for a new teachers union contract, which Martinez and the outgoing school board members refused to do. The battle is what led to recent fallout with calls for Martinez to resign and the mass resignation of Chicago school board members. Mayor Johnson revealed his nominations for new board seats last week. And CPS tells us the vetting process is underway now for those interim board members, which includes things like background checks, financial inquiries and conflicts of interest. CPS does not know when the vetting process will be complete. Meanwhile, a majority of the city's aldermen have signed onto a statement denouncing the recent board instability and the high interest loan. Now, Education Committee Chair Jeanette Taylor tells us that new and old board members were invited to today's committee hearing along with CEO Martinez, but she says all of them, all the board members, did not answer her invitation. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.